and a tent standoff rattles a Santa Maria neighborhood. Police say a man held his girlfriend against her will inside of a home. That man has been identified this evening as 29-year-old Santa Maria resident Eddie Dominguez. Take a look at him. This picture just into our newsroom tonight. The standoff happened just blocks away from Allen Hancock College. Police closed several streets as they negotiated with the suspect over a long period of time. KCY 12 Sean Larson has been covering this story all day. Sean, emotions were running high out there. Scott, Melissa, it was a pretty tense situation in this Santa Maria neighborhood this morning. A man had barricaded himself inside of this home behind me with his girlfriend inside, and he wasn't letting her out. And this all ended with an arrest and this home catching on fire. Concerned neighbors, onlookers, and parents flooded College Drive Wednesday to see what all the commotion was about. It's a scary thought. Like, who wouldn't be scared? Their kids are right there. Our school's right there. Mother of three, Cassie Odom, was also scared for the woman who police said was being held against her will inside this home by her boyfriend, 34-year-old Eddie Dominguez. Dominguez had been wanted for two other domestic violence um, reports from last night after 1 o'clock. Five homes were evacuated and people living in several surrounding homes were asked to shelter in place. Police and a SWAT team tried to negotiate with Dominguez for about four hours. They were eventually able to get the female occupant of the house out and away from the location. They tried to throw Dominguez a phone and played a message from family members on a loudspeaker, but Dominguez wasn't cooperating. Police resorted to tear gas and after several minutes, the home caught on fire. Police say it's unknown if Dominguez deliberately set the fire or if it was caused by the tear gas. We eventually did get Dominguez to surrender to officers at the front of the resident without further incident. The victim was brought to the hospital to be evaluated. Police say they take domestic violence very seriously. It is a concern. It's one of the crimes we'd really like to see stop completely. Um, people have options. And if you're being abused, leave the situation. I was married and becoming a battered wife and the bottom line was that I had a husband that was smoking pot and doing drugs. Contact somebody that can help you. There's help all over. Just call the 1-800 numbers that are on TV or ask for a friend to help you. And the home is not a total loss. Dominguez has been charged with domestic violence, kidnapping and terroristic threats. He's being held in the Santa Barbara County Jail on half a million dollars bond. Live in Santa Maria, Sean Larson, KCOY 12 Central Coast News.